The art of coffee roasting really is an art, as Q13 Fox News anchor Tony Ventrella found out. Right now, he's learning what it takes to make the perfect espresso from start to finish. Welcome back. We're in the Delano's Training Room Cafe, where the uh, the final tasting takes place, right, Phil? So we make sure we've got that smooth product that your customers are used to. Right. we got to make sure that we have the quality up to par so that nobody gets a bad cup of coffee. All right. Well, you uh, you hold the mic and tell me what to do start to finish. Here we go. Well, what we're going to do now is have you pull a shot of coffee because okay. uh, the majority of our customers are getting espresso shots nowadays. So we are going to pull the porta filter out there. Yeah, give it a good it yank. Out straight out. Oh really? <laughs> oh, to the to the left there. Oh, oh like that. Oh, there we God. go. How much is this machine? <laughs> Did I just pay for it? Did I just buy it? Something like that. <laughs> oh. uh, now we're going to pull the lever on the right there to dose our coffee out. Okay. Push the porta filter all the way in. All the way in. Push this all the way. In. There you go. Oh. Why am I not getting anything here? Got to go all the way back with it. There it goes. Oh, I see. I keep doing this. Oh, I see. Is that enough? Oh, my yep. gosh. That's that. gorgeous. Now you're going to skim off the excess so we have the perfect amount of coffee inside there. And then we're going to put uh, 32 pounds with a 90-degree angle. Go ahead and rest it on the counter. There you go. And then flatten that tamper out so you got a good even flat. Dose. That was like 33 pounds. I'm sorry. I think I went a little heavy on that. That'll work. What do I do next? Next, you're going to tap it and uh, polish that off. That'll work. Ooh, that's nice. Now, we put it back up in there. Start the same way, like this. There it goes. Locked in. Okay. Put your shot glasses under there. Where do I put them? Right, right under the two spouts here. That makes sense. And, oh, these are the spouts. Okay. Okay, then what? Hit your white button right there. This one right here? Yep. There we go. And now we're going to see a couple of gorgeous shots that you prepared come out. Here, ooh, look at that. Here they go. Are you excited about this? What are, what are we seeing that you like? We're seeing a lot of really good crema. That crema holds a lot of sugars and oils where the flavor's at. It's all about crema, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> so now you're going to hit that white button again. Right now. <laughs> yeah, but when I tell you. <laughs> yeah. And we've got two shots ready to go, so we can taste those. So I can just pour this into here. Yep, right? pour that right on in there. And we're ready to taste it up. Make sure that your batch pulled out. I don't need to slurp again. This is just a sip, right? Right. Okay. Oh, smooth as can be. That's gorgeous. Thanks for holding the microphone for me. Anytime. So far, so good. I still have a job. <laughs> I think. Where's David? He hasn't fired me yet. <laughs> we'll be back, and we'll be bagging up a special blend here at Delano's next time you see me on the Q13 Fox News this morning, so stick around. Mm, so he's got a new job in the guy. Yeah. And the guy next to him will be his new mic holder. Yeah. <laughs> Did good work there. Walter's digging the little jacket. Oh, I like the jacket. The two stripes. Yeah, it's, yeah. yeah, it's, it's really hip, cool. Kind of hip. speed racer -esque. Yeah. yeah. Remember that go speed racer? Bowling shirt yeah. Thing. And uh, my wife's favorite coffee, by the way, is Delano. Oh, so, yeah. there you go. Let's uh, get out there and show you what you can expect.